Let's talk about MacBook Air 15 inch. This is one of the coolest MacBook Air 15 inch I have seen in a while. And it's probably the MacBook Air 15 inch I wish to see by Apple. And finally when Apple did it, I've been way more excited about this than I have been ever excited about any MacBook lineup. No matter the fact, even if we had the MacBook Air Pro 14 and 16 inch. But regardless of the sizes and the MacBook Air prices, if there's one thing I really love about MacBook Air 15 inch, if I keep if I keep aside the prices and the features it has to offer is the display. Personally, when I saw the MacBook Air 15 inch, to me it did not look like an Apple Mac. To be really honest, it felt like any other ordinary laptop for that instance. Maybe because the size was 15 inch and probably it looked like any Windows laptop, let it be the Lenovo Legion. Let it be like the Dell XPS and somewhat resemblance on the MacBook Air 15 inch. But apart from this, I felt it did not feel like you're using a MacBook. Rather, you felt like you're using any other normal laptop. Just this time, it's just a Mac in the form of a 15 inch. And I, I could possibly see myself getting one. You know why? I prefer a larger display without breaking the and the price should be decent enough. Yeah, it's high, it's a bit high, I do agree. But if you go for a refurbished site via Apple, you can get it for way less, less and probably you can save up money. As for the configuration, I'm still bummed because I feel 256 GB is not worth enough. That to 8, 8 GB of RAM. If Apple had given up 512 GB with 8 G, uh, 16 GB RAM, that would be in the street spot for any macbook in macbook configuration but that only we have with the pro pro macbooks talking about the display i know i'm not sure if i should be really concerned about it since it's mac mac but as someone who has been using 120 hertz sorry 140 hertz on a legion laptop i think i would be a bit mundane about it means a bit i would feel a bit Man about it that MacBook Air 15 inch does not have it. MacBook Air 15 inch has 120 hertz. I'd be really happy. And the only downside for me as a someone who uses prefer laptop over desktop is the portability. I mean, not the portability, rather the port situation. I thought Apple might fix that with the MacBook Air 15 inch, but they kept it as the same as the base MacBook Air 13 inch. Everything is the same. Only you get an extra core and that two full not a bin down version. You get a proper function. Battery life might have we thought might extend, but that did not happen. That's fine. Because if you look at it, Apple has always been good with this battery life across its devices, no matter what. I can tell you ten years of iPad uses iPad we have have. Apple have always kept ten hours of battery life. And each iPad over the years have always had 10 hours of battery life. Some are not good on standby, but it did what it was meant to. So MacBook Air, I feel 15 inch would be one of those will, that will sell like hot cakes. Will age like a fine wine. And probably if I could get myself one, it would be like for me entering into the Mac ecosystem. Because for me, I'm not someone who I still don't know now, but this is just my thought since I I've, I've used the Mac, but not for a very longer duration. Because for me, if I can get Final, I know I could run Final Cut Pro on Mac, Final Cut Pro in Mac. But the downside is for me, it's more about the audio editing side will that I would be able to do. I know Audacity is available on the Mac and it's free. But for me, Audacity and Mac, it's like, you know, it doesn't work for me. I did try Audacity and I, I still prefer the audition. Because that's way better than anything else for me. It's more of if I'll be able to use the apps I require on Mac easily without being on Windows forever. And that's my thought. As for graphic designing and other video designing stuff, I think for me, Mac, uh, Mac should be fine. In for video editing, it's no only that audio side of things. I'm a bit a nitpicky. 
maybe because I understand audio way better than visuals. Either way, if your audio sounds great, then your visual doesn't matter as good, how good it is. It can be 4K, 8K, it doesn't matter. Your audio should be good. And doing YouTube videos, that's one thing I learned. If your audio is good, your video visual doesn't matter as much as long as there's a good storytelling to it. And if you want to subscribe to this channel, do subscribe. I would not possibly make one one video every week. But behind the scene I'm making I'm trying to get video ideas, trying to publish it, trying to be much product up uh, what do you say? Try to up upload here as much as possible. If you do support me, it would go on I could make this channel the what I, I wish to see and help you out way more than I can do at this time. But yes, if you want my help, you can always hang on, chill out with me on Twitter. But that's the place I'm always there. If not in the comment section, you can ask me any questions. I'll be ready to help. Do subscribe to the channel because if you subscribe, there are chances that I might be able to upload way more videos than I'm currently able to do. And do share this video with everyone you know. So for me, Apple, Tech, it's something like I really wish to do for a lifetime. Let's be honest. So yeah, sorry about the mini rant. At times I do rant. I do, I do apologize, but I cannot do anything. Now, yep. As for MacBook, I have 15 inch colors. They are decent. They are good. I surprisingly, I don't know why I like the starlight. It has the goldish wine, whatever you say texture to it but it's really good if i had to configure my macbook as 15 inch for me personally i would have gone with space gray 16 gb ram 512 gb ssd or even one t terabyte since i would be someone who would be not upgrading to mac on a yearly basis or not even five years it won't maybe it as long as it could last yep in case the software needs it if the software is really that lagging or sluggish then i might but otherwise no i like to keep my things for a longer duration of time no matter what it is what tech it is let it be from apple samsung or even headphones for that matter that's what i really love that apple has finally addressed bought the macbook air in 15 inch well now the mac lineup is way better and it's way better because you can you everyone who wants to get into mac ecosystem can get it now than ever it's like how the iOS, sorry, like the way iPhone and iPad have become a part of everyone's life. Now MacBook lineup would be a part of everyone's life. If you can invest as much as possible, the future is going to be as good as you wish to see. Till then, this is your poetic well. Do like, comment and subscribe to the channel. Live your dreams.